Theatre providing the perfect stage for such a grand occasion. I'm Derek Ray and with me here on the commentary box to enjoy the spectacle is Stuart Robson. And we're just moments away from kickoff now in the World Cup final. What do you anticipate seeing, Stuart? Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. And now they get the ball rolling. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Tellez. Neymar, Vinicius Junior, and a strong tackle, and the ball's gone, and in with a real chance, surely, oh there's the goal, there's the opener, how about that? Well you have to admire this bit of play, just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. And so Brazil get the game restarted. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with a quick response? A very good tackle. Oh, they have it again. Vinicius Junior. Application and execution from Jimenez. Take some progress with him. He's in here. Will he? And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space, but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. 2-0 now, and back underway. They know they need to stop him. Opportunity here. Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. Well, that header was never going to be problematic for the goalkeeper. Vinicius Junior. Well, approaching half-time on the home side, very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game, they've won their individual battles, and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. Opportunity! And it goes! A three-goal cushion, and you truly sense it's a matter of how many! Well, I won't get tired of watching this. It's an outstanding bit of play. Just look how far he runs with the ball. That's a great goal. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. And he's in. Couldn't beat the keeper, unfortunately for him. Well, I think that's a bad miss. He just never looked convincing as he went through there. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. Vicius Junior. Gabriel Jesus. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. So back underway here and no sugarcoating it. There was a big gulf between the sides in the first half. Will we see a response from Brazil in the second? And with that, the attack fizzles out. And that's a corner. In position. And cleared away. Went in strongly to win the ball. Strong but fair tackle. Giorgian de Arascaeta. Well, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture.
And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. And foul it is then. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Substitution time it is here. Casemiro. Fred. Gabriel Jesus. Super tackle and they've won possession. Well, they have the ball once more. And they couldn't keep possession. Well, he's allowed it to go over the touchline, so a throw-in. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Tremendously strong in the tackle. And he might be through here. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Important interception. Five minutes left. He continues his run. And let's give credit to the defending. Cleared away comprehensively. Federico Valverde, Torreira, and now it's all over! And they can truly celebrate, because listen to this, they've won the World Cup! And they've done it with style as well. They've been absolutely superb throughout the tournament, and they fully deserved it today.